hello nice people welcome back to my channel don't forget to like share comment and subscribe hit the subscribe button if you're new and for the returning subscribers i love you so much if there is a kenyan celebrity who was an, an apologetic about undergoing body transformation and surgeries then that is the one and only vera sidika not forgetting the advice that she gave her fans and kenyans at large that to get a better body then you have to visit the best experts in surgeries and spend lots of money but to but today she goes against that advice and she has a lot to say maybe this is the era of accepting our bodies the kardashians this year have also removed their implants and they are back to being the skinny babes anyway let me take you through the veracidica body transformation most of the Kenyans and her fans at large know Vera Sidika as a brand, especially when it comes to her curvaceous body. We have seen her enjoy that kind of body that she has, but today she transforms her body back to her normal body that most people have never seen her before. Of course, it shocked many sections of Kenyans. They wanted to know reason behind Vera Sidika doing this, and yet we know that she was an apologetic and no one could ever uh, foresee her removing the implants that she had. We know the kind of money that this babes has spent on surgery, over millions of money, but today she had to give a reason behind that. Posting a photo of her transformed body, Vera Siddiqua had to caption it this way and I'll quote, the rebirth. This has been the hardest phase in my life due to the health risk and complications. I had to undergo surgery. It's still very unbelievable, but I've come to terms with it and learned to love myself regardless. Ladies, please learn to love yourself and don't ever let peer pressure rush you into things that will ruin you in the future. I'm lucky to be alive alive god loves me so much honestly it's been pretty hard i didn't even celebrate my birthday this year but here we are happy birthday to me new me i've come to appreciate life and never take things for granted thanks to my family especially my husband for being there for me to my fans i'm still the same sweetest vera Sidika and hasn't changed i appreciate you all and love for your support and pray that you walk through this journey with me i'll be posting my surgery journey videos here for those who have been thinking of getting a body surgery or changing anything on their bodies this might change your mind peace and love loving emoji Vera Sidika, who regrets what she did to her body, continued to write, and I'll quote, The side effects and risks of body implants and surgeries do exist. The complications are unbearable. Some people don't make it out alive. Some are lucky enough to survive it. Ladies, don't ever do this to yourselves. What even inspired Vera Sidika, a celebrity here in Kenya, to go back to her normal body that she was born with is of this Brazilian model, whereby after she saw photos of her and she had undergone surgery. This is what she had to post and I'll quote, that's what happened to famous Brazilian mod model Adressa Urach because of plastic surgery and hydrogel. Be aware, girls. Vera Sidika went on to write, I used to think otherwise. Maybe they went to bad doctors, etc. But that's not true. Surgeries do have consequences sometimes. Please be careful. You only believe it when reality hits. Of course, we used to see Vera preach and preach that in case you don't want complications, go visit good doctors. She even insisted that here in Kenya, there is nothing that can help you. Vera has, Sidika has been able to go to places like Miami in the US to get surgeries where uh, people like the Kardashians have been able to do their surgeries. But according to Vera right now, that cannot help since whether you get surgery from a very expensive place or a cheap place, it's going to affect you whatsoever. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section. The Kenyan celebrity finished by saying this and I'll quote again, I'll be posting videos of my surgery journey here. From preparations to the actual procedure in the theater, it's been a journey, but I'm so grateful I got a good team that did their best and looked after me. I'll forever be grateful to them. I did go through counseling as well. Acceptance is important and this has made me strong and have courage to come out and to discourage ladies that think surgery fixes it. 
no it doesn't it will only renew from this statement it seems uh vera sidika even did not get a chance to celebrate her birthday we know that the celebrity turned 31 just the other day and it's not normal for her for her not to host our birthday parties during this time but we did not see her doing that so it seems that as she was recovering from the, uh, from the body surgery whereby she decided to go back to her normal body that Kenyans got surprised and of course as I always take you through what a netizens had to say about Vera Sidika changing her body. I'll take you through what celebrities, fans and Kenyans had to say at large and I'll quote. We had a professional photographer here in Kenya known as Yasin saying we can shape it better the editor tried though. Rono was saying end times are near Milichebi. He is a god of second chances. You are still very beautiful. Ready to hear your story. Anita Nderu uh, said this sending you love and hugs. Uh, another one was saying photoshops. Miss Mbali was saying sasa wimbo zote za shape vera sidika wata editama. Uh, Calvin was saying he imeenda he imeenda. Kim Star was saying yani sa, sahi hauna Mm -hmm. We had Jenna saying, thought you said it it was original way. Uh, we said the truth will always come out eventually. Winnie was insisting he ni Photoshop. It seems some of the netizens could not believe Vera could do this. I heard Babishi saying this. Atele siku lijibadilisha ukakuwa mwusi. Hatushtuki ata sayu merudisha ikuendogo. Unafikiri hatukujua waingo. Uh, official, um, this one was saying the nyash is not nashing anymore. Uh, Sherry was saying, uh, sasa manzi wa kibera ataenda wapi na wewe ndo ulikuwa role model wake. Wa, Drip Lode was saying the whatever is not whatever. In, um, Wangeshi Shelly was saying, but you always said uh, it's real. It seems Vera disappointed some of the, her fans uh, by maybe lying to them that the nini was real, her body was real. Uh, we had another one saying, Susan, Saizi Negani, you are our inspiration. Saizi wakamfu kwa waunga. What a disappointment, but ya weza kwa Photoshop pia. Presto was saying, then why do you keep on misleading the girls to get the BBL uplift? Brian was saying, Photoshop and clout is that you, is that you I see. Um, Kambez was saying, sasa utakuwa unakana mgongo. What? This one uh, was really hard. Uh, we had uh, Shark the Youngin saying, glad you are good. Mm, more people are here to uh, not believe that maybe Vera Siddika has been able to undergo this surgery. Some are doubting. Some celebrities were here to wish uh, her all the best and um, to waiting to hear her story as to why uh, she did all this. After Vera Sidika posted her new body transformation, she has received lots of love and also hate at the same time. But if you know Vera, she is one of the celebrities here in Kenya who don't care at all what you're going to say. But with all this being said, let us know your thoughts in the comment section. Are you still in to change and transform your body? As soon as you get money or from Vera's experience, you have changed your mind. Let us know in the comment section. And do you love her new body? Also, let us know all this in the comment section. And that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching this video till the end. I really appreciate. Make sure you give it a big thumbs up to show that you really enjoyed. Comment down below. Let us know your thoughts on Vera Sidika body transformation. If any or you have never subscribed to our channel, hit the subscribe button. Hit that notification bell to always get notified every time we post. And so guys, till next time. Bye.